Well, he is the undisputed greatest Mariner of all time, quite possibly the greatest Seattle athlete of all time. Ken Griffey Jr. led the Mariners to unprecedented heights, probably saved the franchise with the amazing 95 season, which is why Safeco Field is known as the house that Jr. built. He also garnered the highest percentage of votes ever for the Hall of Fame when he was inducted last year. Joining us now, Mariners legend and Hall of Famer Ken Griffey Jr. Joining us courtesy of MLB The Show 17, which is in stores now exclusively for PlayStation. You'll see Jr. on the cover of that. Good morning to you junior good morning how are you i'm great and uh, we'll talk about the game in just a moment and you will receive a huge honor here in seattle this season a new statue will be unveiled at safeco field and you have received some great honors obviously hall of fame your number retired but your own statue i mean that has to rank right up there uh it does um a little overwhelming uh but uh i think i'm gonna get through it uh <laughs> um you know the, the organization has done an unbelievable job uh since I, since I retired and um, I'm just so happy to be part of their their movement and, and trying to bring that that one thing that we haven't done yet and that's get a World Series. Absolutely. Now you've gotten a look at the, the Mariner team, the season opener next Monday. Is this the team that breaks that 15 year playoff drought? I, I think so. Um, I think these guys have, uh, uh, have matured. You know, they're, they're going in the right direction. So that helps. And uh, I think the guys understand what they have to do to to get over that hump. So Seattle, of course, lost the Sonics in 2008. The city working hard to get that new arena built. You know all about this. There's a proposal to renovate Key Arena and another mm -hmm. to build a new arena. It's uh, right next to Safeco Field. So what's your take on the arena here in Seattle and getting the Sonics back? Uh, I think it's very important that we get the Sonics back. Uh, you know, it just the city is complete without the Sonics. And, and uh, uh, you know, it's, it's sorely missed. I've got friends and family who still live there, and they're, uh, they talk about it all the time. I think that uh, my little guy still wears uh, the Sonic jerseys. All right, so you are the cover boy of uh, MLB, the show, 17. That's quite an honor right there. You're a big video game guy. Who is the best video game player in your family? Uh, well, it isn't me. No? No. Um, I can honestly say that it's not me in, in my house. You know, I have a 14-year-old and a 23-year-old who, who play like a work schedule uh, of video games a week. <laughs> uh, I'm on there seven to ten hours. They're on there 45 to 50. <laughs> and, and, and don't let it happen on the weekend, because, uh, but we will pull some all-nighters. I mean, I. At any given time, there'll be three generations of Griffey's playing each other. Uh, so that's the fun part. It gives a chance that, uh, you know, my dad can talk to the boys and, and, and my daughter. So um, we can uh, definitely hold a conversation while they're double teaming and triple teaming me because I think they become some hidden little pack and, and just to try to shoot <laughs> right. bad at night. Uh, colluding <laughs> against you. Um, there's a retro mode in this game as yeah. well where you can actually play yourself, which, which would be just amazing. Really looking forward to playing this. Ken Griffey Jr., thank you for your time. Good to have you this morning. No, Mom, thank you. And you can check out uh, MLB 17, the show, which is in stores right now on PlayStation. Good stuff.